And every game played here is pretty special. The cop is unique for its atmosphere, an atmosphere enhanced by this splendid new main stand. A warm welcome to you from Anfield. The teams then, Liverpool against Porto. I'm Peter Drury, and it's a pleasure to be alongside Jim Beck. Thanks, Peter. It's a pleasure and a privilege for me to be here. And so, the distinctive sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem. So that's got things underway. How do you, Jim, see making a difference here? It's Casillas for me, because if he gets a little busy in this game, he has the talent and vast experience to cope with pretty much anything. He can be an extremely reassuring presence here. Yes, they'll certainly be leaning heavily on him. Keeps everyone guessing. Where to from here? And that's a goal kick. Jordan Henderson. Milner. Jordan Henderson. Milner. And it's Firmino. Firmino really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. <laughs> Mohamed Salah. Ball is over the line. Oh, that's not going to go down too well with his teammates. Promising move that. Good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. He hits it! And he's there to make a great save. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Played out to the right. Looks like a good ball through. Into the channel. And Dyke gets into the right position to intercept. There really wasn't very much in that. Not far away from being a telling final ball. Porta just had to make the ball stick, but came up short. Danger averted for now. Going through. And a header! He will be livid with himself. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. He's got away. He's a clever pass. Now here's the through ball. A boot up for the header. That's a half-decent try. Vincent Aboubacar did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Henderson with the ball through. Herrera. Aboubacar. Looks to slip it through. Rahimi has it in a wide position, so what next? Gets up to head it! And we've reached half-time. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. Liverpool head to the dressing room, not yet having broken through. Tight, cagey game. Find the team any further forward than they were when they started out. We're probably into the second 45 minutes. Tight old game so far. Can that change now? Milner. Good defending there. They've slammed the door in the faces of the opposition. Firmino passes it through. Oh, he's broken through. Mohamed Salah! They're actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No. It's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Over to the left. And it's Alex Tellez.
It's a boomer car! He's been off try. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. Oh, he really wanted that. Well, Peter, I think it's fairly obvious he's one of the biggest influences out there. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Oh, throw in. Porto have decided now is the time to make their final change. Signer, that is for the opposition. There really isn't much time to get a goal back now. Talking about drama. Cassias reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Well, it still had to be finished off, so well done to the goal scorer, but the keeper should have done a lot better. Deadlock broken. It's 1-0. Well, when the going gets tough, etc., um, they can still turn this round, I think. Very well to intervene. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Uh, that was just poor decision making and a weak execution. And Mane! Mohamed Salah gets it back. Can he score? Good try. The outcome could so easily have been different. Salah decides to play it back. And the counter is on. Look, their supporters must be going barmy about this because there's no sense of purpose in what we're seeing. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. <laughs> 